Welcome to Metal Gods TV. Hi, I'm Metal Gods TV, and I'm with A Joker's Rage. So, hi guys. Afternoon. Hello. 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 Uh, how did you say go earlier? Absolutely sensational. Yeah. Yeah. You've got to start your makeup. That's uh, <laughs> that's a sign of hard work. <laughs> how did you sound and everything? Was everything all cool? And it was brilliant. We yeah, had a couple of good. couple of issues. Matt's uh, kick drum pedal broke halfway yeah, through. Oh, but, no. but we, yeah. we, we improvised and made a little song up with the audience and kept the vibe going. It was fantastic. Everyone was, their response was just, couldn't have asked for more. Did you really. get a good crowd in? We did. Yeah, great crowd. Yeah. Being the yeah. first band on as well, it was uh, it was even more impressive, really. We were so happy with the response. And yeah. Everyone was brilliant. It's so amazing, wow. everyone boxed up at one o'clock. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's it was like, it's like everyone's going to still be in bed, so we know it's going to be getting over. <laughs> but yeah, the boot, boot was packed, it was brilliant. Oh, yeah. good. Yeah. Is this your first time to Hammerfest? It is. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
so that's the pre-production at the minute. Um, going really well, we're really excited about what we're, what we're writing there, so um, hopefully kind of, at some point later on this year we'll, uh, we'll be able to get that out, we'll start promoting it, so uh, yeah, Are we're really excited. Are yourselves or? Uh, pre-production, yeah, I mean we're quite lucky because we have um, a lot of oil well, gear and whatnot, so um, Quite lucky because you, you can do it. <laughs> that, yeah, as well, that's why I'm talking. Matt's, <laughs> Matt's, Matt's uh, um, a lot more than just a drummer, put it that way. Matt's, Matt's great in terms of he, he, he can produce and he can, um, you know, he's a fantastic pianist. And, and so we can we can pre record everything to how we want before we then go and take it to a bigger studio and then re record it all properly. Um, so we're experimenting at the moment um, and we're just going to. We're going to keep everyone updated. We're going to drop teasers in there. We're going to drop a few little songs here and there and see what people think and uh, just keep experimenting. You know? yeah. What about what's um, what kind of style have you gone for? Are you sticking with what you know best or are you going a little bit? We don't have a style. We, have not we yet. don't have a style. <laughs> you know, one, about minute, one minute you, it, it might be a, a, a disco rock song. And the next minute we might be screaming like metal. We don't have a style, so yeah. we we go through loads of phase. I mean, a, yeah. a lot of the tracks in I say at the minute uh, will go from you know so much of fully orchestrated to um, just a real simple four to the floor dance groove. Um, I mean, some of the stuff we're doing right now we're messing around with a lot of electronics and things as well, um, which we've had a little bit in the past. But that being said, I think as part of our writing process, things come and things go, and you know we. we we just really work on it until we're really, really happy with it. Feel at the time, yeah, yeah, absolutely. You know, we, we won't settle for thinking, oh well, this has to have electronics in it because all the rest of the tracks do. Or yeah. you yeah. know, we have to have this kind of formula. If we don't fit, or we're not feeling it. We'll take it out, and, and we won't release it until we're, we're really happy with it. Yeah. We, we definitely create in the moment, as opposed to saying, oh, we need to write an album that sounds like this, or we need to. We just create in the moment and see what comes out. When you release that, hopefully in the summer, if you can. Uh, get probably it be a little bit. Yeah, it'll probably be a little bit later. <laughs> Are you going to try and get it sort of get a tour sorted out of the UK and? Yeah, sure. I mean, it's great because uh, as we mentioned, all these festival days which are keeping us going while we're while we're doing all the writing. Um, so it'll probably be like kind of later on in the year we'll get that. But yeah, I mean, the toys and, and everything like that. Um, it's just all coming in, isn't it? Yeah. It's all while we're while we're obviously writing at the moment. We keep getting uh, offers or bookings for like these festivals and, and, and whatnot, and it's it's really great because it's um, it, you know it's really hard when you're, you you're applying to play things all the time or you you're begging somebody who knows a promoter you know get me a show. Yeah. And obviously we've all been through that before, and this year just seems to be we haven't applied for anything. Yeah. Um, it, it's all just coming in naturally, and, and, and so we're taking that as a positive and just oh, yeah, absolutely. doing yeah. our yeah. best. It's, it's really humbling. Yeah. Yeah. Being invited to places is a lot more of a privilege than sort of, please put me on. Yeah, sort exactly. Of thing, yeah. So. And that's the thing, you know, it's, it's our first time to one of these festivals, so our aim is just to, to get there. It doesn't matter what slot, I mean, we, you know, we were the first band on today. It doesn't matter where we get put on, we're always just kind of aim to absolutely own yeah. whatever we do, you know, just kind of really set, set our goals. And, you know, hopefully next year we'll get invited down and we'll be further down the list and new festivals and you know, we, we just want to keep this momentum going for us. Yeah, yeah well, we're really proud of the fact that this momentum has been, is, is, is been achieved from people seeing us play live and not based on like Facebook likes or stuff like that, do you know yeah. what I mean? It's, yeah. it's like old school. Yeah. You go see a band, they tell everyone and they say, oh, we, we want that band to play this and, and it's like, it's great, it's very humbling. I think one of the trigger points is really the HRH gig in Sheffield. Yeah, year, the you know, uh, um, Highway to Hell. Yeah, which we, to be honest, we, we've been contacted by someone saying, oh, we want to nominate you for this. We think you've done that really well. And I'm like, yeah, well, yeah, you know, kind of. Um, to be fair, we're a little bit scared of this light. Is it going to be a battle of the bars? Kind of, you know, I think we've been apprehensive a little bit in terms of how we would get down to things, but the reception we received was just amazing. Um, the you know, snowball. It put, it put a move that, you know, they didn't know who we were. And, um, now it's just taken off. Yeah, yeah we were panicked because we went to we went into that kind of blind um, in respect that all the other bands kind of like buses and fans and yeah, yeah. friends <laughs> and even people yeah. from abroad and stuff and we were like oh my god yeah. and we were the first band on in the day and <laughs> yeah. we didn't have we had we had we actually had my fiance there didn't we? That was we had one we had one, one person, person. <laughs> that, that knew us and supported us yeah. and what I was gobsmacked was 
the voting system was uh, was the people had to vote on, a, on an app or an email. Oh, right, yeah. The people actually in the crowd who watched the show after a band, they vote for them or whatever. Yeah. So the fact that we got we came second out of 19, oh, 19 wow. bands yeah. and we had no fans, like none of our own yeah. people yeah. there. And so the fact that they, they voted for us, we were just absolutely amazed. And yeah. since that was a big, that was a big kick up the ass for us. We were like, come on, let's, let's if it's, we can do this, you know. It does. I mean, it happens. I mean, you get the bands that go into metal to the masses and things like that, and they're just kind of sort of coast along, doing yeah. local gigs and stuff. But as soon as they get in there and they realise, oh, actually, you know, we can do something with this. It's kind of, it is like a big kick up the backside, and it's kind of. Well, actually, we need to get going and do some stuff now, you know, and really get out there and out and about, and yeah, out of your local county. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Yeah. Across the rest of the country. Yeah. Well, thanks, guys, for your time. If you've got a message but for Metal Gods TV. Metal Gods TV. This is a joker's rage. Keep it heavy. Thank you very much. Thanks. May God have mercy on your soul.